Happy New Year's Eve. I'm meteorologist Liz Horton in our CBS4 weather control with a look at your big celebration forecast. Let's show you those low temperatures this morning. Chilly lower 50s out there from Opelika to Oakland Park and upper 50s in Miami. Still very chilly in West Kendall in the upper 40s. When you compare that though with the wind chill across most of the northern half of the United States, we are very lucky. Felt like 35 below this morning in Minneapolis, single digits in Cincinnati, D.C., and negative numbers there in New York City. Later today here will be beautiful, partly sunny and cool, 72 degrees, north winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. And Mariners, things look good for you. Seas 2 to 3 feet with a light chop on the bays. If you're celebrating tonight and you're going to see a little firework action, things look okay for you. Lower 60s, pretty cool though, so make sure you add long sleeves or jackets or pants into your forecasted outfit plan there. Uh, as you head on through the next couple days, we're going to see changes. So high pressure over our region now, that will be fading away very quickly as an area of low pressure over the Gulf and a cold front moves straight on through. So we'll see north and central Florida being impacted on New Year's Day early in the morning with rain overspreading the area. That will move down through our region overnight into early Tuesday, bringing us chances of rain and some heavy rainfall possible by Tuesday night into Wednesday as well. Your seven-day outlook does does show that temperatures will stay in the 70s until that front pulls away. Cooler, drier air will likely move in as an area of low pressure develops off of our coast, bringing 60s for Thursday and Friday. And yes, both days will likely see those lows in the 40s. So get those jackets ready. We hope that you have a wonderful, safe, and happy, healthy new year here, all from all of us here at CBS4. Thanks again for logging on and have a wonderful night.